YouTube, what's up, what's up? Monday, October 17th, it's about 9.30. Had a great weekend and I hope you guys enjoyed it. City's on fire after the Eagles are doing what they're doing. So uh, shout out to everybody supporting the Eagles out there. So there were some packages that we didn't quite get to because USPS showed up right when we left. All this from USPS that has to get taken care of and I already put some stuff away from uh, from Amazon that showed up. So. Unfortunately, Francisco called out today. I miss you, bro. If you're watching this, man, I miss you, man. So that means all day Monday is going to be me. We're doing a new format now. So we're doing weekly vlogs. And uh, we're getting close to the holiday season, so I'm expecting a lot of packages. And, uh, you know, we're going to get started. So happy Monday. Hi, YouTube. What's that you eating? A lollipop. A lollipop? Where'd you get that? From the corner store. From the corner store. Yeah, they love you over there. So we got some packages here. So uh, let's open these up. Right, so got some Adidas pants, got some lighters because we always light the incense up. We shouldn't be have to run out for the next 20 years. A tablet stand and another tape measure here. Hey, what's up Fishbox friends, what's up? It's Wednesday morning. It's about 9:10. So I hope you guys had a great day yesterday and hope you guys are having a great day today. I'm expecting Francisco to come in a little bit later today. I'm expecting actually I don't know what to expect today as far as the amount of packages that come in. Got my son's costume. We'll open up this a little bit later. I'm going to try to put this bike away. Ride out season is pretty much over at least for me. It's getting a little cold outside and I don't really need it. I need more space and normally I have it sitting up front. Then I bring it to the back, and then I put it back to the front, and then I bring it back to the back. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it in the basement and get rid of this, and uh, you know we'll just go about our day. So we back. Hey, what's up, guys? How's it going? You got plans for Halloween, man? You got a, a costume idea you're thinking about? Uh, like a zombie doctor. A zombie like, doctor? Yeah. Okay, you know Halloween is on, I think it's on a Monday. Oh, yeah? You know fish box is open on a Monday. Oh, okay. You're you, you going to bring it to the, to the, to the office, or are you going to wear it after? Uh, it depends. Okay. I'll see. <laughs> All right. Day in Philadelphia, it'll be partly cloudy, with a forecasted high of 55 and a low of 40. You hear that, bro? Yeah, it's getting cool. You know it comes after 40, 30. And you know when it gets 30, 32 degrees is freezing temperature. It can start snowing, so you might want to start getting your blanket together. Yeah. So it looks like we're live, and hopefully we'll get some customers from that. It's Napoleon from Fishbox. Sorry I missed you a little earlier today. No worries, no worries. I had a package that was supposed to be delivered. I didn't realize on... Uh, Sunday, October 8th, mm -hmm. and it was supposed to be delivered to fish box, which obviously you're not open, and when I went to the tracking, it said delivered to a safe place. Okay. Uh, Do you know what that means? So if you can send me the tracking number along with the time that it says it arrived, that'll be great. And they also sometimes send a picture if they say they left it at a secure spot, so if you have that picture, that'll be very helpful. I don't have anything. I actually, they don't even, they have it as delivered. Okay. I called them while I was waiting for you. I got so you. I actually canceled. I had them refund me. I was just calling to see if you knew, like, if there was some deal set up safe place was next door or something. I didn't know. So we can end this. I'll just reorder it. Okay. I, I've gotten my money back, but I just wanted to make sure that um, it wasn't sitting around there somewhere. Yeah, we are all good, but thank you so much for everything. All right, so it looks like what happened is a customer ordered something. It got delivered on Sunday. Fishbox was closed on Sunday. Amazon marked it as delivered. Customer never got it. So one of two things happened. It probably definitely didn't get left outside because I got a camera outside that if it would have been left outside, I would have came to get it. But what most likely probably happened is they either delivered it to the wrong address or they marked it as delivered and it just wasn't delivered. 
Believe it or not, Amazon does this very often, unfortunately. This thing barely ever happens, and if it does happen, it always gets resolved. Yo, bro. Sergeant Coley, what's up, man? What's up, bro? Yo, it went good, man. I mean, I've never seen that process before, that in-depth. It took 12 hours and two days. Yeah. But yeah, man, um, they started development on Monday. So we gave them our budget. They said they could, they could do it. And, but that leads me. I was going to talk to you about this next mm. weekend when we plan to meet up, man. But I need beta testers. Okay. Oh, yeah. Bro, anything I can do to help, man, for sure. Oh, bro, I pick up the car Friday, man. The canoe or the Tesla? The Tesla. This Friday? Oh, so you know we got to hang out. Man, listen, let me hit up Jordan. I'll definitely come if it's just you and me. But, you you uh, got it. All right, bro. All right, man. All right, All right. peace. Thank you for calling Fishbox. How can I help you today? Shit. Hello? Hello? Oh, crap. You hearing this, bro? Yeah. I don't know what that is. Yo, you too. What up? What up? Good morning. Thursday. It's about 9.20 in the morning and uh, just got some packages ready over here for a customer that's about to pick up 17 packages. Honestly, I don't really know what's going to happen today. We're going to see. Uh, probably going to be cleaning up the store, of course, a little bit, rearranging things, trying new things out. So a lot of y'all may be wondering what software I use when I do this. So that software allows me to take a picture of a package. It could recognize the name on the package and automatically send an email with the tracking information and a picture of the label to the customer so they know when the package arrives. It's called Envoy. If you're gonna run a mailbox store, you definitely need to check it out. I'll put a link somewhere down here where you guys can go download it or something like that. Not an ad, it's a little expensive. I think it's about $275 a month. But if you're having trouble accounting for packages in your store, it may be an option for you. All right, so it's official. It's about 3.45 right now on a Thursday. The vlog comes out tomorrow at noon, so less than 24 hours from now, and I just finished uploading it to YouTube. So that's just a huge weight off my shoulders now. So now I can kind of chill for the rest of the day. It's about 3.45, so which means that I got a few hours left in the fish box store before I started deliveries, but at least I don't have the vlog to worry about. Yo guys, what up, what up? Towards the end of today, it's about 6.20, so I'm pretty much gonna shut things down now. I got some deliveries for tonight. I got this big guy, everything that's in there plus that. So I'm gonna be busy tonight. Another busy day in the books, but feeling good about it. And tomorrow's gonna be Friday. You too, you too, what up? Happy Friday. And I think today's gonna be a great day. It'll be just me today. Let's check out the office and see what it's looking like. Looks like, uh, you know, pretty average. I wouldn't say it's a lot. I wouldn't say it's, I'd say it's probably more on the empty side to be honest with you, which is good. And Friday is the busiest day as far as people coming to pick up packages. So uh, I'm expecting it to look a lot less packed in here, which is cool. You know, I always appreciate that. And then as we get closer to November, things filling up again and helping customers out with their packages. Thank you for calling Fishbox. How can I help you today? Keeping your customers from finding you. Please press one. It was Friday afternoon and on Friday, I like to enjoy a little happy hour at the office. That's the beauty of owning your own store. You can do what you want. I'm not trying to get wasted in the store, but I like to have just a nice little beer or two, a little craft beer. All right, any of y'all craft beer sippers? Any of y'all craft beer lovers? Leave your favorite craft beer in the comments. Let me know what y'all like. Yo, yo, what up guys, what up? So USPS and FedEx just showed up with all this, all this, and all that over there. So uh, I'm gonna have to get to work cause it's Friday and in about an hour, every Fish Boss customer is gonna come in to pick up their packages. So let me get to work. I'm not sure if you guys remember the last video, but we did a test to see how fast could it be from a customer coming in to pick up a package to the time they leave. So we'll see if I can break that record today all by myself, so stay tuned. So I'm gonna clear this to zero, and we'll, whoop, to zero, and we'll see what's up. Thirty-five point eight three seconds. The old record 
was 57.65. So it looks like I, I beat it by almost 20 seconds. Now ask yourself, can you go to the post office and pick up your package in 35 seconds? Thank you for calling Fishbox. How can I help you today? Oh, hey, man. Uh, I'm the, the guy that sent you that email. <laughs> uh, which, um, one, which one, man? I've been getting a lot of emails lately. <laughs> so I'm the one that, that bought that uh, independently owned mailbox. Oh, nice, man. Nice, nice. Glad, thank, that, glad to meet you, man. And thank you for uh, checking out the vlog. So yesterday, it was official. I put down the earnest money. Um, now I'm getting all the insurance stuff going. Yeah, and the crazy thing is that this one is one of three. Uh, I'm in Utah, by the way. I'm, I'm not sure how, like, your industry is over there and how many is, like, within your area. Oh, we, we got three that are less than a block away. <laughs> no way. A brand new place. You know, everything's brand new. And it, it's kind of like yours, like, the way you have yours set up. And I love it. Is there anything I can do to help? I, I definitely want to see you, you succeed. It seems like you're a really awesome person. And I was like, man, like, I've never been in that city or state. So I was like, I'd, I'd be willing to fly out there for a weekend and just obviously just kind of like follow you. I've never got that offer before, but you know, that that sounds cool, man. Maybe next week we could uh, like officially schedule like a Zoom call. Oh man, yeah, I'll, I'll send you a follow up email. And okay. We'll touch base, you know, and go, and go from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that, man. And, and congratulations on opening up the store. You know, salute to you. And yeah, definitely send me an email and we'll go from there. Awesome, man. Thank you. Hey, no, thank you, man. I appreciate you reaching out. And thank you so much for checking out the vlog. I, that really does mean a lot. Keep it up. I, I love seeing the hustle. <laughs> Likewise, man. All right. Be safe, bro. All right. You too. Thank you. All right. Bye. Yo, that was so cool. You know, it's about 625 now. I'm going to end the vlog there for today. And. I'll see you guys tomorrow. So it's Saturday, October 22nd. I got Jonathan and Francisco here helping out. We'll see what type of things we get into on this Saturday. This here. Perfect. Hey, no Thank you. No hey, what's up, fish box friends? So it's almost towards the end of today. It's about 1.15. And I just want to give you guys an update on the numbers this week. So let's see what we got. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring up the analytics that we have just to look at the amount of packages that we got delivered to the fish box store this week. So last week we had 955 packages. And let's see what we have this week. 900 this week versus 955 last week. So that Amazon Prime Day thing that they had definitely contributed. So I'll go ahead and end the vlog right there. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.